Game division of Ikea. We're starting strong. Uh, it's a construction game. All of our games are construction. We are Ikea. Yo, uh, masterclass of storytelling. I don't know about the PC as like a developing uh, market for video games. Like, I think the Gomodora 64 is gonna be around to the end of time. Oh, Jesus. Okay, we haven't got a lot in the way of graphics, so we're just gonna have to make it a text-based adventure game. We're a bit short on resources right now. I think we're in the 80s. Well, you know, the quest is paramount. The gameplay is literally sitting in a bush for 20 minutes and sometimes you win. Uh, BP, thank you for the 8 quid. Here's some fun bucks. Thank you very much. That's what we'll have instead of V-bucks. F-bucks. The F is for fun. Time to time, there will also be bug points generated. These bugs points become less likely once you gain experience. Bugs should be fixed before the game is released and increase development time and cost. You see, Mr. Tutorial, you say that now, but have you heard of Fallout 76? Fortnite 2, Fort Harder is ready. <laughs> it's my first game. Here we go. Oh, it's... Okay, bumpy stone. <laughs> Abysmal. Oh, they get, it's not a one. It's not a one. We're the Atari of the gaming industry, okay? Absolute titan. This will never possibly I, I go out of game development. We don't need story. We want gameplay and engine. Uh, and Java isn't exactly ideal, so let's just lower engine a little. <laughs> level design is the most important thing, because you're literally designing the level. Fortnite 2, Fort Harder is now off the market too. A brief insight as to what 2021 looks like. Minecraft tree, what's Minecraft tree? We, we gotta make the follow-up sequel, because this one's gonna be a hit. We don't even need to wait for the sales. It's, it's pretty bad. <laughs> Meh, two stars. I'll take it. Oh, your bank account is in the red. Thankfully, your bank has enabled you to overdraw your account up to 50k, but be careful. If your account balance is below 50k, you'll go bankrupt. Okay, so we gotta make this count. Oh! <gasps> Fun at stages! Has its moments. Put it on the box. <laughs> Three out of five stars. <laughs> so now we're just gonna pump out Minecraft clones until we go under. Because this is what the market wants. We gotta pull like an Assassin's Creed on this. Every single year, sometimes even two a year. Minecraft 4. Buy our goddamn game. Minecraft 3, Steve dies again, was so successful that we now have eight fans. <laughs> Yo, Fallout 76 is eight fans as well. So I'll, I'll take being on par with Fallout 76. I'll do it. No, oh, we've oversaturated the market. Okay, we made we made too many Minecraft get another simulation construction game. They're on to us. Okay, Minecraft's a dead IP. Let's just pull the plug. It's never gonna take off. Minecraft tree was the best one. It's abstract. Um, oh, I gotta hurry. Yeah, I, I need to finish the game quickly. Abstract and adventure is a great combination. We've saved the studio! They love it! Please buy this or I'll be homeless has achieved a company sales record with over 10,000 units sold. This is an important milestone in the history of IKEA. We saved it! <laughs> the company is afloat! We're gonna call this the abstract engine. We're gonna make not the Sims. It's great! Played it for days. What would be a good fit for the Ninvento? Oh, wait, I got it. We're gonna make like a crappy golf game. We Sports Resortum. It could have been better. They shouldn't forget about sound. I've seen better. It has its moments. Oh no, it's just another crappy golf game. Assassin game. RPG. We're gonna make a masterclass of storytelling. We're in the red again, minus 28k. We need another success. Oh no. And just make everything literally the same. But it's now for a mature audience. Plan GG has recently published an interview with IKEA. 
According to the interview, the company is working on its first game targeted at mature players. Mr. Alan Key, owner and CEO of IKEA, said, We think that players are looking for more mature content in games, and we are willing to take a risk to give it to them. At the beginning of your career, hype is mostly generated through random events. Once you gain more experience, you can use marketing and other strategies. Soon we can just market a game altogether and not actually develop it. Once again, Fallout 76. We got a hit. Played it for days. Screw the kids. The kids don't have money. Kids don't have disposable income. Parents do. Wait, no. Not parents, because that's just for, that's the child market. Adults do. This is gonna be crappy roller coaster tycoon. We made the Ocarina of Time of roller coaster tycoon games. Fuck you, informed gamer. You know, you've lowered the Metacritic score. Oh my god. <laughs> you make quite every self save a lot of capital. If you want to grow the company further, then move it into a new office is the next step. It only costs 150k. Look how much money we made. According to our market research, the recently published game Crappy Roller Coaster Tycoon is a surprise hit with players. Roller IKEA is fairly new to the gaming industry, but cannot wait to see what they develop next. Sure, go on. I, I want to see what that looks like. Open world Tetris. Oh no. No, we're, we're making this one big. People tell me to go small. We're making it a big game. Skyrim 2, guys. Everyone who said this would be a flop. Where are you now? That's a good game. Sony PlayStation All Stars Racing. We did it again. Sony PlayStation All Stars All Stars Battle Racing. One of the best games ever made. And you guys say I don't know video games. I I should go into the industry myself. Zombie action for a mature audience. Uh, you just put it on PC. Wait, why did someone? Someone said the date and dead. Okay, it's a zombie. It's a mature zombie romance game with a lot of action. If you know what I'm saying. <laughs> 3D graphics. Oh, Jesus. Oh, it's mediocre. <laughs> we tried to do too much. It's Chrono Trigger 2. Oh, actually, no, wait, that exists. Um, 2.5. You know how every Call of Duty game is branded as mature? And the main target demographic is, like, nine-year-olds. That's basically what we're doing. You know, you market and sell towards the adults. The kids look at them, they think it's cool, and that's what they want to play. Boss, it seems like quite a few players use illegal copies of Wii Music 2, Ryan dies. I've managed to identify some of them. We could either sue them to defend our copyright or send them warnings to ask them to stop. Okay, that's not advertiser friendly. <laughs> right away. Oh, we lost a lot of fans for that. Our fans just halved. Oh, we shouldn't have done that at all. Oh, we might be okay though. We have a heavily marketed game. And it's a banger. This is gonna be crappier. Roller Coaster Tycoon. Perfect tens. Come on. 10. Come on. 10. Come on. <laughs> One more. All games, I'm suing you. Oh, you're a terrible establishment. Oh my god, look how much it's sold! <gasps> oh. It's a half a million copies of a game without the help of a publisher. Crappy Rollercoaster Tycoon, the newest game by IKEA, has caused a storm of good reviews to excited customers. Industry professionals say that Crappy Rollercoaster Tycoon is one of those rare games that will set a new quality standard for future games. We made game in history. Sony Superstars. Sonic is drifting. <laughs> Need less engine. But guys, the, the big selling point is that this is gonna be the multiplayer racer. Okay, let's, let's just go with what the stats say. Just pure gameplay. Hey, uh, Tracy, you're new. <laughs> We're gonna go with the big boy campaign, two million. Global marketing campaign. And your top readers are curious about what decisions go into making a video game and how companies prioritize development areas. Your new game is a racing casual game. Can you tell us whether such a game would re usually receive more focus on world design or more on graphic? The graphics. Yeah, like we're in the gaming generation where people are flaunting the amount of pixels. Let's do a se Can we do a second campaign? Or is that a terrible mistake to do two? That's too much. 
<laughs> like we just start popping like flyers in everyone's door. It's like buy our video game. <laughs> Big game conventions coming up. Large boot. Well, the hype is now massive. It's 143. Oh, it might be mediocre. Okay, game here. That's the one we put on the box. I think we need like to make Spider-Man or something. We've done it again. Just like that. Mature, we're going for the PC audience again. It's been a while. Fall down 77. Post-apocalyptic RPG on the PC. What's your expectation regarding the success of Fall down 67? Do you think that the game will be well received? Hype game. Thank you for your time. Artificial intelligence, who needs it? Let's launch a large campaign. Here we go. Okay, hype's going through the roof now. <laughs> I don't know if Tracy can take anything else on. No, yeah, I'd rather Tracy dies than let Patrick work on this. Oh, there's a lot of bugs. Okay, iron them out. This is actually a stage in the process that Bethesda forgot to do themselves. Okay, hype is now 233. <laughs> Launch. <gasps> We fixed it! We fixed Fallout 76! Dear esteemed sir, madam, I'm a financial advisor to CEO at Womoba Oil Limited in Nigeria. I'm writing to you because I know of your high repute and trustworthiness. My CEO has authorized me to invest 2.5 million in IKEA. If you have deposited the amount in a safe bank account, will transfer this money to you, but the bank requires confirmation from you. If you wish to receive the funds, you must transfer a one-time verification payment of 120k. I trust in you. The thing is, because this is so obviously a scam, and I imagine the devs expect you to treat it as a scam. Gullibility tax, god damn it. Uh, it was worth a shot, guys. It was it was worth a shot. Look, they just have my credentials, okay? I trust them. An exclusive interview a while ago, Mr. Alan Key from Ikea made a very bold remark about their then-in-development game Fall Down 70 67, predicting that it would be uber successful. Now the game is out in the market, the consensus is that Mr. Alan Key was spot on! <laughs> The game has received very positive reviews. This has had a positive effect on sales. We did it, Todd. We can't, if we do PC every time, they're like, we'll oversaturate it. We need to save the RPG for like, cause that's gonna be our next release. Yeah, so we're doing play system. Clear trend towards, bollocks. <laughs> no! Oh no! Oh no! Okay, guys, don't spend <laughs> We gotta cut costs. Oh no. <laughs> it developed sequel. We got we gotta go quick. We gotta go quick. Put in all the same stuff as before. We just we need some money. This is your company has some serious financial difficulty. The company is about to go bankrupt. Patrick, we're going under. You can't be asking for a raise. Patrick, you're fired. Oh no. Oh <laughs> no. Oh, it's not going well. We've ruined the franchise. 